<laughs> hey, Scott, I don't know. If, I don't know if you were aware, Scott, but Charles was present in the news box. Thankfully, we were able to send him to the Battle in the Valley. New Japan Pro Wrestling had an incredible event in San Jose at the Civic Auditorium, 2,500 strong, and thankfully, Suplex's own Charles Marquez was there in person, was able to get quite a bit of footage and Thank you so much, Charles, for being there for posterity. And I know you had an awesome time. Really, there's a couple of standout moments of the night, but nobody stands out more than the coming out party for the former Sasha Banks, the New Japan Pro Wrestling in-ring debut of Mercedes Monet. Charles, what was it like to be in the Civic Auditorium with 2,500 rabid, insane wrestling fans getting an opportunity to see puro resu in person and getting to see mercedes Mar monet capture the iwgp women's championship well jj and scott uh, i would say rabid is probably an understatement i could not believe my eyes when i got into that uh, auditorium uh, i walked in there these folks were just going crazy you know seeing the new japan ring knowing that not only Mercedes Monet and Kyrie were going to be wrestling, but of course the living legend himself, Okada, was on the card uh, in the main event or the co-main event with Tanahashi, and so was Jay White and Eddie Kingston. Uh, it was unbelievable. Everybody there was so hyped up for the thing. And of course, man, if you haven't seen, I know you guys have, but for our listeners out there, if you haven't really taken a close look at New Japan, go check it out because what they put out is un believable i couldn't believe it thank you guys yeah incredible in-ring action from all of the footage that has been out there of course most of the footage that's been out there our very own charles marquez is the one who filmed it and you'll be seeing a lot of his footage out there online some of it already getting bootlegged but there were some awesome moments including mercedes monet and Kyrie battling up the ramp and Kyrie putting mercedes monet through a table and some have said that might have been a spot that wasn't really necessary as they had an absolutely incredible match. And the match was deemed by most, including Charles, the match of the night. Uh, Scott, I know you saw some of that footage and I know you were a big fan of the women's revolution as Sasha, Bailey, Becky Lynch and Charlotte were really taking off and elevating women in pro wrestling. Are you happy to see her in a different environment? and standing out and able to uh, to really showcase that incredible talent that she possesses. Man, I'll tell you what. First of all, Charles, I'm so glad you're able to go to that show because the videos that you took and the the messages that you sent us, boy, I, I, I would have loved to have been to that show because it, it looked amazing. But as far as Mercedes Monet, she is a talent. She's a phenomenal talent. She's a generational talent. And New Japan recognizes that. And they made her the second, only the second IWPG woman's champion. And she, she just, she, that match with Kyrie was outstanding. It was over the top great. Not for the high spots, not for the, the stunts, but just for the story they told in the wrestling. They have a great person to carry the women's title for New Japan. And I know she's not scheduled to wrestle every single week on New Japan you know, every other day in New Japan. She has a limited schedule. So it's going to allow her to do some other things. And so we may get to see her in some other areas. I, I know that there's a there's a show coming up this summer called Forbidden Door with New Japan. You never know what may happen. But yeah, no, Mercedes Monet, tremendous talent. The videos that Charles took, keep up the great work. <laughs> As of right now, Mercedes Monet is currently only contracted for a couple of more events uh, through New Japan. Not that she won't renew that and come up with some more, but as of right now, she has two more matches with New Japan and Stardom that are scheduled. I'd love to see her perform at Forbidden Door and to be able to mix it up with some of that great AEW talent that's out there. It was encouraging to hear that she uh, she did an interview 
uh, post-match, after the match, and said that she got an incredible text of encouragement from Triple H, as well as a really, really sweet text from William Regal, that they acknowledged her and supported her and wanted her to just do well. And we're just wishing her the best of luck. So Mercedes, we hope to see some more great stuff out of you. It was really neat to get to see you happy as you were dancing about. And you also paid tribute with that beautiful five-star frog splash uh, to Latino Heat, Eddie Guerrero, at one point in the match. And man, that warmed my heart because I know that she was in the crowd when Eddie Guerrero was announced as passed away. She was there to see him. So it's just really neat that she's doing something that she's talked about for years and years. And uh, I look forward to more great action out of Mercedes, who is now the CEO of the women's division. 